Hey guys, I'm Trevin. I'm Connor. And what are we looking for? Bank teller, poor seems black customer. In this video, we're gonna react to a bank teller, poor seems black customer. Yeah. We're going to react to the live action version. You. What? Come out. Why? And there it is. Hey, you guys. The. Whoa. And well, it start, kind of starts off with. Hey, guys. I'm well, super excited for you to watch wacky today's video. Dar Man I right want to let you know some really well, exciting news the, that the Dar Man Studios behind the, the video, scenes YouTube the actual channel video is officially live. I've been asking you guys what yeah. you want to see more of, and I've been reading in the comments, and everyone's like, they want to meet the cast, they want to meet yo, the crew, they want to see what happens behind the scenes. Because you'll see the behind the. Hey, Meta, take a photo. Yo the scenes so now you can experience all of that through our yes. new youtube channel go ahead and check yeah, it out the link yes. is down in the description uh, plus we're going to be doing right some there. really right awesome there. giveaways for those that subscribe so you don't want to miss it let's go ahead and start today's video because oh, it starts with a special announcement done behind the scenes yeah of the yes. part three of the sniper wolf collab oh yeah don't worry about it there you go have a nice day Good afternoon. I'd like to make a deposit. And there's E.P. Evan. Oh, um, this is for business clientele. Yeah. The regular line is out there. I'm in the right spot. <laughs> I just left the gym. Anyways, I need to make a deposit. You! What? Why? <laughs> Your turn. Oh, where on earth did you get this yeah. cash? What? Cut it out. Business. Why? <laughs> Look. Before we go any further, I need to see some ID. Is this really you? Uh, yeah. Yes, it's really me. I need to see another form of ID. What for? This is the first time I've ever been asked that. Well, according to bank rules, I have the right to ask if I suspect any suspicious activity. She's stereotyping. Suspicious EP activity? Evan. Yeah. Because that's a thing no, of no, no. right there. Yeah. This is my college ID. That should work. Stanford? You really expect me to believe that you went to Stanford? This is a fake ID. Now, yeah. I need to see a passport or something more official. Why would I carry a passport to the bank? Oh, you want to be a smart yeah. guy. Mary, can you come in here, please? Does this look real to you? Uh, yeah, that's definitely real. Okay, thanks. I need to count this. Okay. Oh. <clears throat> I'd like to deposit this, too. $20,000. Seriously, what are you doing with this kind of money? It's not any of your business. This is from DM Capital. You really expect me to believe that you work there? This is a fraudulent check, isn't it? You're more than welcome to call She's the company and confirm you yourself. God, you probably yeah, don't I mean, even have a real job. Yeah. Why don't I call security instead? You, you never know. He's you know what? the owner. I had enough of this. Yeah. Just give me my cash and check so I can go. Security! Is everything okay? 
No, hey, it's not. Doesn't he look like this a man rock? gave me a fake yeah. ID, lied about his job, and now he's trying to deposit a fraudulent check. More than like she's stereotyping me while I'm just trying to make a simple transaction. Oh, you people are so typical. Always using she race as your scene. get out of jail free card. I know a crook when I see one. Rude. Rude. She caused yeah. the scene. Everything that you yeah. just said could not be further from the truth. You see? Why is great dumb dumb flashback? You said I didn't go to college. But he did. But the truth is, yeah. not only did I go to one of the most prestigious schools in the country, I also graduated at the top of my class. I even started my own little company after graduation. And over time, that little company turned into a really big company. And now it's one of the most successful financial institutions in our city today. So you see, never judge a book by its cover because I'm not only an employee for DM Capital, I'm the CEO. <laughs> you expect for us to believe that. Get him out of here. You can tell he's a liar. What if he's telling the truth? Maybe you should call the number of the company just to be sure. He's telling the truth. Yeah. Okay. Fine. He was telling the truth all along. Yeah. But she Hi, yeah, this is lying. Karen from World City Bank. No, he's not. Yeah. I have someone here who's trying to cash a fraudulent check. Can you transfer me to the owner, please? Thanks. You see? You're calling. You see? You're, You're calling me. She was like, what? I don't understand. Mr. Moore. John Harris. John. Yeah. Good to see you. Sir, you know this guy? Yes, this is Daniel. Daniel Moore, owner of DM Capital, our biggest client. This guy. DM. Is our Daniel biggest Moore. client. Yeah. Yes. And your man. Yeah. Is everything all right here? No, John. Everything is not okay. You see, Karen here just stereotyped me because of the way that I look. That's four times so you see it's her. Yeah. I mean, can you blame me? Just look at him. You should know better than to ever judge a book by its cover. Mr. Moore, I am so sorry. I assure you this will never happen again. Because Karen here is fired. What? Oh. Fired. Fired? Wash out. No, you can't do that. I just did. Yeah. Will you make sure she gets all of her things? And Mr. Moore, I would love to assist you in my private office. Please follow me. Thank you. She's starting to regret. I'm innocent. He didn't do it. I know he did it. He's calling for it right there. I love you so much. If he's telling the truth, who cares whether he did it or not? It's never too late to do the right thing. People like him are all the same. Just a bunch of criminals. That's utterly racist. Yeah. You can't treat people like that. No. Because it's rude. It's rude. It's racist. It's racist. And you can get fired for that. And a job, yes. You can't judge a, you can't judge a book by its cover. So guess what? Heather Norland did that too. But what's different is th in, this one. In, uh, in Karen calls comp on the member two bikes. Here, Heather Norland is not working. And the life lesson is you should never judge somebody before you get to know them. Yeah. So it never does a book by its cover. That's this one. But Rebecca Ritz, she plays Karen in this video. Yeah. Life lesson is you should never judge a book by its cover, like you said. Right. Because we should never judge a book by its cover, and we should never judge somebody before you, we get to know them. Yeah. We don't know their story. No.
Why are you wearing Christmas socks? Because I got these for Christmas. Like last it is year. Not Christmas. I know. We've been doing weird things lately. Yeah. Because you. So coincidence that I heard bring me to life late last night. Like, like three days. Midnight. Mountain daylight time. Yeah, because not only it does start a new day. But it still counts as three days in a row. Yeah. You heard that song three days in a row too. Yeah. What the heck? This is weird. This is weird. We both heard yellow at the same time. Talk about weird. Can things just get a whole lot weirder? Yeah. Because things got a whole lot weirder. And... I remember we both said, this is just a punk of me in the world, this is the number in my ear. This is really a bump that connected me. I've been shouting in a year. Twice. And, on the same day. Yes. There's a deer in your shirt. Need to look. No. What? Ow. What? Well, that was the first. Yeah. <laughs> we did that twice. Yeah. Because... Second time I was on Night to Shine. I sang another one rides the bus. Yeah. Even live on stage. Even the line, there's a suitcase poking me in the ribs. There's a yellow in my ear. There's a smell your bum standing next to me. Haven't showered in a year. Uh -huh. I know. Speaking of which, I heard that dirty yesterday. Wait, what? Yes, what? I sang the whole song. Even the like, there's a suitcase poking me in the ribs. There's a elbow in my ear. There's a smell your bum standing next to me. Haven't showered in a year. Ha uh ha. -huh. I know. I tell you, another one rides the bus. That dirty just keeps getting.